guys, Groody, Groody's Race and Rest Day. Thought I'd show you E34 after cores. Haven't slammed it, slammed it, but it is low. Alright. Very, very funny. Uh, he's got a real nice set of wheels to go on this car. I'll leave the caps off because I've checked the wheel nuts. Always leave the caps off until the wheel nuts are checked. Uh, nice car. Looks good this height. Funny little thing, this one had a uh, a miss when it started. The exhaust shop that did the exhaust told him it started just after they did the exhaust. So they told him it would be the O2 sensor. And they paid for an O2 sensor. He bought a pair. I put a pair of O2 sensors in, still had a miss. So I did a few little bits of investigation and found that the ECU was crook. So they'd left the ECU connected when they were the exhaust. Now they said that they've put a clamp on, like an earthing clamp. Now, I know of another E34 with this issue, but not as dramatic. So I'm going to have a chat with them. It's actually one that I did an exhaust on. I hadn't disconnected the ECU on this one. This was years ago. And usually, I don't have any issues. But, it looks like now, usually I just disconnect the negative lead, and I'm fine. But definitely, if you're going to do any welding, especially on these old girls, especially with old ECUs that are probably past their uh, heat cycle rate, I'll call it, yeah. It'll pay to disconnect the ECU totally before you do any welding on the exhaust. Yeah, you can kind of see the height. I'll probably get a photo of it. He'll send me a photo once he puts his wheels and stuff on. He had to wait for some spaces because his wheel specs were a little wrong. Yeah, one and a half degrees neg on the front. So it should steer real nice. Nice car. Thought I'd show you the uh, finished product. I don't know how good you can see all this stuff, but yeah, there you go, that's a bit better. So, tiny little bit of wheel gap on the front. And uh, tiny little bit of tuck on the rear. Yeah, have a lovely day. Thanks for your time. E34, coilovers.